Chief Executive Officer of the Fair Wages and Salaries Commission, Engineer Ben Atta, was reacting to concerns by some public sector workers that they will benefit from the 30% increment. He said the 30% is meant for only those on the single spine salary structure. He cautioned chief executive officers of state-owned enterprises not to increase salaries of staff without approval from the commission. If a head of entity sits somewhere, if that entity has weaned itself of the, uh, the single spine and hears that we are giving 30% and goes to slap 30%, on their workers without authorization from us and Ministry of Finance. Definitely, you have issues to deal with as far as the auditor or auditing is concerned, because you don't have the appropriate authority or mandate to do that. So it's not for all public sector workers. It's for those who are on the single spine and those who expressly will be allowed go by the 30 percent on productivity he explained that the commission has begun a process of collaborating with the public services commission to set targets for workers this time set targets for the organizations employees management and the rest so that by the end of the year we should be able to measure each individual's performance and be able to get the score so that your movement on your pay structure will be informed by your performance as well. Does it know all these years, these things are not uh, The structures have been built, but it's not been implemented. He again emphasized on the digital initiatives that will afford the Commission to do payroll monitoring to reduce ghost names. Part of the payroll monitoring is to ensure that workers who deserve allowances under the single spine salary structure are paid. When we talk about payroll monitoring, do not limit your to that of controller. So we want to be able to collaborate with the necessary institutions and stakeholders to be able to do that. If we're able to be able to clean the, the pay all very well, I can tell you we'll be able to free space for those who are deserving of it to enjoy and enjoy well. And I think it's a commitment that we need to make.